Good Tuesday evening, and thanks for logging on to your AccuLand Carpet One forecast. I'm meteorologist Natalie Ferrari, and as we wrap up another quiet and mild evening, those temperatures are steadily starting to make their way now towards the mid-70s. Currently looking at 79 in College Station, so a little bit more mild through the city of College Station, 74 right now through Bryan. Winds trying to pick up a little bit of speed, but for the most part, struggling to do so. But again, those temperatures are slowly trying to make their way now into the mid-70s across the board. A few areas a little bit more mild and others a little bit cooler, but we will all steadily fall together. Winds actually have really calmed down out towards our far western counties and our far eastern counties, barely trying to get them out of the east now here in town, about seven miles per hour. But don't worry, that won't stick around for much longer. We also been keeping a close eye on what's happening out in the tropics out in the eastern pacific we have two hurricanes two category one hurricanes that first one off to the far left there is hurricane andres and blanca hurricane blanca now just hanging out just south of mexico what this will do is try to make its way towards the baja peninsula as far as that second hurricane hurricane blanca and then we'll be watching what the leftover moisture does next week some of that may try to help increase rain chances here at home again that's just looking far ahead though for now we'll We'll just worry about what's happening this week, and that's just going to be a whole lot of sunshine, barely a lot of cloud cover to talk about across the state, or even rain chances. Overnight, we'll keep partly cloudy skies, becoming mostly clear off and on throughout the overnight and morning hours for tomorrow morning as we wake up near the upper 60s. Temperatures skyrocket right back to the upper 80s. Wouldn't be surprised if we actually do reach 90 degrees in a few areas as that sunshine continues to pump on lots of heat, as well as winds shifting out of the south returning that warm, muggy Gulf air again out of the Gulf of Mexico. So that is mainly the trend that we're going to be looking at over the next couple of days where we'll have seasonable overnight temperatures near the upper 60s and lower 70s. Tonight won't be any exception as we make our way towards the overnight hours and into Wednesday morning. And then daytime highs continuing to make their way in the upper 80s, easily making their way then into the lower 90s just in time for the weekend with a good sun cloud mix. Those winds out of the south will really be helping to warm things up as well as that humidity does increase so just don't be surprised when things start to feel a whole lot more muggy over the next couple of days as well but hey at least for the most part we'll stay rain free if we do see any rain chances it would barely be a 10 percent chance of an isolated stray shower in the afternoon one of those things that if you blink you might miss it that's how stray those shower chances would be other than that we are going to stay dry through the rest of the week